Hi, my name is Gertrude Mache. I'm an independent filmmaker from Wellington, New Zealand. I'm an African storyteller. And every once in a while in your life, you meet someone who is truly inspirational, who rises above others and really lights the way. I'm in Albuquerque, New Mexico because of one young man. His name is Mark Anthony Romero. I met him six, seven weeks ago as I was on my way to Los Angeles to start my film career. And I cannot describe what the last six weeks have been like. Mark Anthony has humbled me. He has made me look at my own life and think of the many things I want to do and how I can do them. He's an incredible human being and I feel really honored to be working with him and collaborating with him to work on this documentary, to help him with this book, to mentor him as an international speaker because I think that we change lives through our stories. The power of the personal story. Why it's important to me is because when you read somebody's book, when you listen to somebody tell their personal story, they are letting you into their world. And for a brief moment, you get to experience what it is to be in their shoes. So here I am in the land of enchantment, having never dreamt that I would live in this magical city. What I've experienced with day one of shooting this documentary is this. Mark Anthony was born to a very special set of parents. Two people who were given a gift, they realized it from day one and they committed that they will nurture and look after that gift as much as they could. I've met his brother, his sister, his friends, his grandfather, and in just one day I've kind of come to understand to realize where he draws his strength. And I'm hoping that as I follow his story and track him for the next five years, we will be able to bring you into his life so that you can stop and think about who you are. You can ask yourself why you're here. You can ask yourself what difference you're going to make before you die. One of the things that I love most about Mark is his sense of humor. I have met a guy who can't walk, who can't use his hands, but has fractured an ankle because of all of the adventures he's been through. In just this one day, we have laughed, we have cried. I have experienced exactly what his mother and father have gone through, because I'm a mother too. I have three children and I'm hoping that if anybody out there has a child who has special needs, you don't give up on them. I'm hoping that as an individual, if you ever meet a person who is physically or mentally challenged, you don't make assumptions about who they are. You stop and you give them a chance to show you who they are and you get to know them. So this documentary is being put together to not only inspire, but I really think that Mark Antony is a living legacy. A lot of people will go through their lives, they will make lots of money and then leave a chunk of change to make a difference in the world. I think every single time he just shows up to give a presentation, or a talk, or if you bump into him into the street, just by being himself, he already helps you reframe. His biggest gift, I feel, is that he gives people contrast. Because when I met Mark Anthony, I stopped and I thought, I have fingers, I have toes, I have so many dreams. The things that I've always wanted to do with my life, what's stopping me? So thank you for watching this first episode. I hope that you will come along with us on this roller coaster ride of what's coming.
because already he has had a lot of ups and a lot of downs. But the one thing that he told me is that when he hits rock bottom, he gets excited because the only way from there is up. 